News Talk Breakfast. In association with AIR. Seamless connections with Ireland's number one broadband provider. An exciting hunting on Seeker Stag and Wild Goat in beautiful County Kerry in South West Ireland. That is the tagline being sold by a Danish and Scottish company, Scotsport Ireland. They're selling it to potential hunter tourists. Uh, Ted Cronin, founder of the Kerry-based Animal Rights Party Ireland. Your reaction to these type of holidays being offered in your beloved kingdom? Yeah, I think it's um, desperate and deplorable. Um, I mean, these holiday the packages offering tourists the chance to shoot deer and wild mountain goats and carry. Um, Kerry is known for its beauty, its mountains, its lakes, its beaches, and it doesn't want to become known as, as a destination for trophy hunters. Will there be some people in Kerry who will say, you know what, I don't really, I'm not too pushed about whether people shoot or not, but it'll certainly bring revenue into the local uh, the local economy? Well, you'll get that in any place, but I mean, Kerry is a tourist county. And the majority of people will be against hunting. Our party are, are totally against hunting and blood sports. And unfortunately, don't have, we don't have any help from, from certain politicians who are big intent to, into here coursing, fox hunting, calling of deer, calling of the protected grey seal. So I doubt if, if they're going to be very supportive in trying to get these trophy hunters holidays out of the kingdom. Okay, I think there's obviously five uh, TDs in Kerry. There's the two Healy Rays, there's a Sinn Féin seat, there's a, a Fine Gael seat, uh, and yeah. there's a Fianna Fáil uh, minister there. Are any of them supportive of your campaign? Uh, no. Does that reflect a wider support among the people, do you think, for allowing this kind of tourism? I don't think so. I mean, when it comes to here, of course, in uh, 75-80% of people reject here course and don't want it and at the same time it's, it keeps going on every year so I don't think it reflects the people just the politicians You're going to organise protests against this? Well hopefully when things get back to normal we want to meet up with these people and talk to them and explain our situation a lot of these companies are foreign companies sending in people for seven days and making big money out of pure cruelty so Hopefully we will have peaceful protests um, when things get back to normal after COVID. Yeah, now, I suppose important to say it's not illegal to hunt stag and deer and carry once the relevant licences are obtained. It's not illegal, but that doesn't mean it's right. And as I said, the majority of people would be against this kind of activity. And Kerry doesn't want to be known as a county for trophy hunting. OK, we'll leave it there. Ted Cronin, founder of the Kerry-based Animal Rights Party Ireland. Thanks indeed for talking to News Talk Breakfast this morning. 